In this video, I'm gonna show you how to download and install Simple Voice Chat for Minecraft Java. So, let's get started. The first thing you wanna do is go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here, you want to go to your search bar, and you want to search up mod Wind, like so, and now you want to enter. From there, you want to go to modern.com and click on modern, and from there, you'll be on the modern homepage. Now, all you want to do is go to discover content on the top of the website, and then you want to go down to mods. Now, you want to go to search mods, and you want to search up simple voice chat, so simple voice chat, and now you want to click on the mods name here, and it will bring you to this page here. So from there, you want to go to versions, and now you want to go to game versions, and you want to choose what Minecraft Java version you want to play. I'm going to choose the latest one they have here, which is also the latest Minecraft version. And here, we will be using Fabric for today's tutorial. So just find Fabric and your version name here, and I'll click the green download button that shows up. And you're now done with Modulinth. So from there, you want to go to a new tab, and you want to go to your search bar to search up Fabric Minecraft. And from there, you want to enter, and here you'll find FabricMC.net, just click on Fabric. And it will bring you to this page here where you want to go to downloads. And from there, you want to go to download for Windows here. And you now have Fabric as well. So you want to have Fabric and Voice Chat here. And then you're done basically with your web browser. So you can minimize or close your web browser. And from there, you can go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. Here, you want to go to Fabric Installer. You want to double click the file here. And it will show up with a window here where you can select the Minecraft Java version you want to play. Make sure this matches voice chat here, so we'll be using 1.21.5 as this is 1.21.5 here. And here, just do install. Okay, and close. And now, all you want to do is go to your Minecraft launcher, and you have to wait for the Minecraft launcher to open up, and then we'll be able to go ahead and add a simple voice chat to the mods folder. So basically, here you have Fabric Loader, and then you want to go to installations here on the top. Then you want to hover over Fabric Loader and go to the folder icon. From there, you want to find mods. And then you have to double click on the folder. It will bring you here. And then you want to go to downloads. You want to select and copy sample voice chat. And then you want to go to the top left arrow to go back to your previous folder and click paste. So here we copy pasted voice chat in .minecraft mods here. So once you have this layout, all you want to do is go to your Minecraft launcher. Then you want to go to play, make sure fabric is your selected loader here, and I'll just do play. And now you have to wait for Minecraft to open up. Okay, so once you have Minecraft here, you can go to a single player world for example, or you can also go to a server if it supports voice chat as well. So that is quite interesting, but for now we'll just be doing single player as the setup process works on both and either way. So basically, once we go to a single player world, all you want to do is go ahead and wait for the little tutorial thing that shows up. So basically, here you can see on the bottom, it tells us to do V to set up. So all you want to do here is click V. And here we have a little tutorial here, which honestly is quite useful, so we can go through it as well. So basically, you want to go to next here. And here, you're going to have your microphone, which asks you to basically select what you want to do. So here, we have my external microphone, and here we have an application voice mod microphone, which is actually a virtual mic. But basically, all your mics will just show up here, and you can select which one you want to use. Make sure this is the one you actually want to use. And once you select it, it will become green, and I'll just do next. Here for your speakers, it is the same thing, but basically for the speakers you want to be listening to that. So basically, here, sometimes the microphone will be selected as a speaker, which is not, it's a microphone. Here we have different, basically, speakers that we can go ahead and choose from. And if you don't know which one you, you want to use, you can always just try and error it, or you can just basically know which one you want to use. For example, here we can see that here we have a uh, AMD, so this will be a graphics card one, so no. Here we have voice mod again, just like the microphone, it is virtual, so no. This is a microphone. So this is the only one that is actually external. So we'll be using that one, right? And from there, we'll just do next. And here we have our activation method, which is push to talk or voice activation. So this basically 
is every time you talk it will just be activated and this is every time you click a specific key it will be on so this one will technically have better quality if you specifically do something here which is not here so for example if we go with voice activation which is honestly the best one i think just because it's you don't have to think about it basically you have to do voice activation you can do this if you want but i'll just do this and here this is what makes this a good thing compared to the key if you do it right so for example here we see that we have our microphone which is uh, muted right now and as you heard that quite loud but you can see that it goes up automatically so basically anything lower than this well it will keep doing this because of this but basically the idea is if you have it really low it will basically go anywhere from here to here you can listen it but if you go here you you will basically just activate only here now the reverb you hear is just because it's catching itself back it's the classic like infinite loop thing but basically yeah, that, that's the idea here so yeah you can just basically choose how loud you want to, the microphone to pick up your voice to activate it here so we'll just do this this is also very really useful with how loud your room is for example whatever so i'll just keep it like this for example this is also to how make it basically how loud you want it to be and this is just no suppression which you don't want to use but yeah you can mess with these later but this is the one which is important and this is the one which is here so basically if we do next we finished and now we can just do finish out and there you go so here our microphone is currently off so we need to go on v and as you can see it is off here so if i click this button anyone with a mod on server at least can just go ahead and hear what i'm saying right now so yeah that is the idea with all of that so yeah that is how we download and install simple voice chat for minecraft java so if you like this video make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one bye